Well, it's a bright Saturday morning, 7.15. I got the boss's car today. Boss is in New York. I got a big scissor gig. No knives. Maybe one knife. Some guy might bring me in a big Bowie knife, he said. This is my scissor rig. Low Tide Tim's working the market. We'll see how it goes. Both would be really, really windy. He might have a hard time with the tent. I don't know. It's 20 to 30, they call it, for a few minutes in some rain later on. We'll have to go and see. I'll get back to you. This book is, uh, they call it the Spring Fling. It opens at 9. And the way it sounds, they have classes on how to make quilts. They do this thing every year for like 20 years. And the old guy who's been sharpening that scissors apparently passed away or quit sharpening. I don't, I never did get the details. All I know is I got an invitation in uh, December or January. If I get there by 8 o'clock, they feed me breakfast. Show starts at 9. And at 12 o'clock they break for lunch and they feed you lunch. I could have 40, 50, 100 pairs of scissors. I don't know. She got a guarantee almost of 50, she said. But we'll have to see how that goes. I guess all kinds of scissors. I got a whole box of scissors that I... I remember that picture I showed you last week? Um, all kinds of scissors I'm going to try and sell, so... She said that would be okay. I got tinkers and street scissors and good scissors and junk scissors and I got them from a dollar a pair to as much as ten dollars a pair. Normally at these fairs and places we just have a license to service. We can't sell anything. But this is a separate entity. Yes, you know, no license required. It's a church. It goes on a big Baptist church. Okay. That's it. For later. Breakfast. Second go round, ham quiche. Well, I got my first pair, but it doesn't look to me, they didn't eat anything. They're just as sharp as I could ever make them. They just got a little stuff on the blade right now. I'm gonna dust that off a little bit. All right, here's the way they're coming. They come in bags. This bag has two. The lady's name is Holly. This lady has one pair. And in here is a five dollar bill, and in here is two fives or a ten. The first action. You see why I brought the buffer? <coughs> Made in the USA, but they're in nasty condition. Things are picking up. They even got a knife. Look at this. Mm, that means in there. <laughs> Pink as you just do the tips. Remember I told you the wind was coming? I had to run inside, had to leave. It started snowing. We actually had snow flurries. It was bad. Oh. 
Woo, baby. I'm inside now. Nice and warm. <laughs> Chicken salad on wheat. Close up there, you turkey. It's lunchtime at the gig. My buddy Tracy just came by and brought me a thing of scissor oil. He buys a great big like 16 or 20 ounce container from Woof. And he gets these little bottles from somewhere and puts it in there. It's like uh, some kind of mineral. I don't Well, I don't know what kind of oil it is, but it's got paraffin in it. It's really nice oil. Makes, does a good job on scissors. Headed home now. A little shade after two. It was just that one big wave, and that's all it was. The lady said we thought there might be some more, but at 1:30 she told me no, that was it. Let's go ahead and pack up and take off. So I did. I talked to Low Tide Tim. He did uh, nine or ten knives at the market. He said it was kind of slow and really, really windy there on the bay. Blowed over the big uh, produce people's tent to win all two pieces, he said. Uh, he said it was only eight vendors there. So it wasn't a very pretty day there where he was. Nor was it where I was until I went inside. It got, you know, it got bad. And it's still bad. It's overcast and blowing about 30 right now. Be some, some thick egos maybe after this little puff of wind.